Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It is Brittany's. In today's video, I have part two of my synthetic wig, half wig with headbands video. So I posted my other one about a week or two ago and you guys responded really well to it. That was like my first time doing like a try on video with the wigs in that format, a chat, just chatting a lot and talking to you guys and you guys seem to enjoy it. You guys know by now, if you don't, the headband wigs, the human hair headband wigs have been trending for the last um, month or so, month and a half. I have featured a lot of human hair wigs on my channel, but you guys requested that I do some synthetic wigs with some headbands and I did that in that video. Um, other people have started to do similar videos to the one that I did, so if you wanna see the kinds of, the different kinds of synthetic wigs that they feature in their video, you can definitely check those out. I have watched, I have watched Is That Your Hair? She did one recently and Deanna Monet has, and I think a lot of other people are gonna start following suit and doing the same thing as well. Yeah, so this is also a headband haul video. So I asked you guys in part one, did you want to see the headbands that I bought from Amazon recently and pretty much everybody who commented said they wanted to see it. So uh, the first part of this video is gonna be me unboxing all the headbands that I got from Amazon. Second part is gonna be me trying on some more uh, synthetic half wigs with some of the headbands that I picked up from Amazon. So all the links will be down in the description box if you want to purchase them and they will be affiliate links. So if you purchase those headbands using my affiliate links, you are helping out my channel. So let's get into it. All right, we got the overhead shot going on. So these are all the headbands that I ordered from Amazon. I'm gonna go, go ahead and take them out the box and then we'll go package by package and I'll show you each one. So here is the first one here. Now this is like a metal kind of Grecian style headband. And I saw Miss Naturally Mary wear this in one of her videos and I picked it up. She had the gold. Um, this one is more of a rose gold. Very pretty, very regal and sophisticated. This would be really pretty for um, a bride I think I wanna go back and get like just the straight up gold cause I wear gold so much, but I think it's so, so pretty. I have a multi-pack here and these all have bows on them. These are super cute. I like that. I ordered this stuff like as soon as the part one was finished. So I forgot exactly what I ordered. So this is exciting. I think it's so, so cute. Leopard and then the bow on it is solid. And then I have one that is like a leopard print, cheetah print, and it has a black bow on it. And then we got some polka dots, black and white. Um, and then this is kind of a mustard color. I love mustard. And then we have this one that is red, giving me Minnie Mouse. I like that. Okay, I got another set. These are kind of more of a sweater material, which is gonna be great for fall, winter. So this burgundy color, this blush color here. This is, okay, so here is mustard. This is more of a light brown in comparison. In comparison, they're, they're different. I was gonna call this mustard, but it's not. It's, it's like a mustardy brown, but this is like a true mustard. And then I have black, of course. And then I have this kind of heather gray. Okay, so here's these kind of plain Jane Bowens. These kind of look like they would be good for like little girls and stuff, but I'm still gonna wear some of these. So here is bright. Here's a pink color. We got green, hot pink, black. I think it's nice to have the solid colors as well. Here's red. It, on camera, it looks a little orange, but it's actually red. Yellow, here's a true orange, and white. Oh yes. Last but not least, I have these. Okay, so this came as a gift. This is like a polka dot black scrunchie. But let's get into these headbands. So these, I think I saw these on Miss Naturally Mary as well. So these have pearls on them. I'm not into rhinestones, but I will do pearls. I think these are really, really pretty. Again, this looks like something you would wear for like 
Christmas pictures or something. Really cute. This is like a ivory kind of cream color. We have this. It's a velvet material. This is a pink velvet. Black velvet with pearls. And then we have black velvet. This mustardy yellow velvet here. And this olive green. I think these colors are unique, especially with the fabric. All right, so you guys saw all the headbands from my haul. I Literally, this is probably like 20 of them in addition to all the ones that I got from working with all those other companies. So I'm about to try on some of these wigs that I got. I told you guys soon after part one, I went ahead and ordered a few more. All right, first up is a wig from Altre. This is in the style Sicily and I have it in a DR30. This is what she looks like on the stock card. I like that she had, first of all, a little bit of color to her with a dark root and she has nice waves in it. So I wanted to pick that up. I haven't tried any of these on at all. So this is what Sicily, Sicily looks like with the waves and the color, the root is dark. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and slick my edges down because I will be trying on all these half wigs. Of course, I'm gonna be using the She Is Bomb edge control here. It's great for my type four hair. So I'm just gonna wet my edges up a little bit. And if you are new here, thank you for subscribing and shout out to my premiere squad that's watching this with me now. I was uh, thinking like, how, how long have we been calling premiere squad premiere squad? So I looked on my community tab because last year, it's about to be a year that we've been the premiere squad. So, um, so the premiere started to take off and I was like, we need a name. So I asked you guys, did you want to be called Chat Fam or Premier Squad? And you guys voted for Premier Squad. So you guys have been helping so much with growth with my channel. And it's really nice to interact with you guys in real time. So I appreciate you guys supporting. And if you're watching the replay and you want to be a part of Premier Squad, all you have to do is turn on your notifications and you should be notified every time I do, every time I upload and do premieres. I might try it on straight first and then turn it to the side like I showed you guys. If you want to flip over, look, you kind of put your comb off to the side versus putting it in the middle. That's a trick I used to do back in the day. Okay, so with this construction, you have two small combs instead of that one big comb that's going to rip your hair out. So it's going to be a bit safer. It has adjustable straps and a comb in the back as well. I like this color. Okay, this color looks very pretty. Uh -huh. Just fluffing it out a little bit more. So this is very cute. I like this color. I am six feet tall, so this falls on me about, I don't know, 18 inches. It's not super full, but it's not thin to where you would see tracks or anything like that. Let's try it on with some headbands, shall we? put my hoops on. I bought some new hoops from Fashion Nova. These are probably the biggest ones I've owned. The ones you usually see me with, the ones you usually see me with in my videos is from Shein and I bought them like two years ago, but they're starting to turn. So I wanted to pick up some new ones. This is super cute. I'm gonna take some pictures in this one. Just gotta make sure your wig line is covered with your headband. I think this one is really cute. I like the color of it. Let's try it on with a few more headbands. Yeah, I took off my hoops just to change the vibe a bit with this. But this is very pretty and like 
fairy tale like just be careful because this one is thinner and I can see like my wig line the difference there but still cute and all of these headbands the good thing about it obviously this is a I don't not like I said in part one I don't knock people that want to buy the human hair ones or the synthetic ones um, just know the synthetic ones won't last as long unless you rotate it out with other wigs and you can extend the life of it and use detangling sprays and and stuff like that to comb out the nape. I'm just try on this one. That's really pretty. Ooh, this is so cute. I love the velvet ones. Like that is so feminine and beautiful. A little bit of tangling, a little bit of tangling. But if you don't, if you are someone who you don't really care about the quality necessarily of your hair, then just stick with the synthetic half wigs with a headband. But if you're somebody who's gonna want some longevity and stuff like that, then the human hair ones are probably better suited for you. By now, I have reviewed a ton of them at a ton of different price points. The synthetic ones, the mid-tier, more affordable human hair ones, and then the higher end ones like Her Given Hair and My First Wig. It's something out there for everybody. I like that it has a dark root so it's not just all color. Okay, next wig is Outre's Jeanette in color two. This is what she looks like. I bought her probably two or three months ago just because I was like, huh, oh, let me see what the half wig's hitting for it. And this was kind of, I wasn't even thinking about, you know, doing the headband thing, but it fits. So I'm gonna try it today. It has a beautiful blown out, like yakky texture. Now, even though this is a blowout kind of texture, it is not rough and hard very soft so this is what the cap construction so this is what the cap construction looks like so i guess that i guess with the more modern half wigs that have come out they have smaller combs and it's just one and two and then one in the back and adjustable straps so of course i had to get some blacks because i do prefer to have my half wigs black because they just naturally go with my edges but a little color is nice too. This is really, really pretty. Let me go ahead and loosen up the uniform look a little bit. So this is what it's looking like in all directions. It looks like it's about 16 inches on me and I'm six feet tall. So if you're shorter than me, it's going to be longer. Texture is beautiful, but I can see how it could get very like, or lion's mane really quick. This one be, would be really cute in a ponytail. I might do, let's see how I like it. This is a velvet pearl one. This one's kind of need some direction to it. Let me try it on with a different headband. Let's try this one. Put this one up because I don't know how I feel about it all the way down so I have this large band here these this is for like thicker hair and if you're gonna put it up in the ponytail you gotta make sure the back is covered with a wider headband so we gotta make sure it's covered back here Ooh, it's kind of giving me that side pony that I kind of did with my her giving hair one. But this is a ride set kind of look. Putting my hoops.
So I'm just putting bobby pins in it to kind of shape it to kind of a top bun. Give it a bit more structure. Is this low key turning into a WAP style? Jeanette up in this bun is a vibe for real. I feel like a queen of sorts. I don't know. It's just a vibe with this one. So let's move on to the next one. All right. Next up we have Sensationals Alpha Woman. This is from the Curls, Kinks, and Co. collection. I have it in a number and I have it in a number two. This is for curl types 3B to 4C. I am not new to Alpha Woman. I review Alpha Woman and is it Boss Babe, I think? I think I reviewed those. I reviewed both of them at the beginning of the year and I did not like them. But I'm thinking the half wick version is gonna look more natural because I have my own edges out. And this is textured, so high hopes for this. So this is what Alpha Woman looks like on the stock card. Very beautiful. This is a thick texture, so fall, winter, this is that kind of wig. This is what Alpha Woman looks like. Um, this is a number two, it has a like a brown cast over it. So this is a little bit lighter than most of my number twos tend to be. It has an overall kind of like chocolate brown look to it. So this is gonna be similar to Outre's Annie that I reviewed um, or that I featured in part one of this video. So this one does have a long comb there. You get a comb in the back and adjustable strap. So let's just try it on and see. Okay, this texture feels really, really good. Really, really good. Y'all see it. It's not like crinkles or anything in it. Oh, it's some, okay. A little bit of tangling. But if you are getting it, getting a synthetic half wig, you just gotta know. It's gonna be a better price, but it's, you're gonna have some hiccups, a little bit of tangling, shedding. Beautiful everyday length. Already here for the length, y'all. Here for it. Okay, let's see how it looks with this. Alpha Woman, the half wig version is a winner. Get this one. Beautiful length, it's like 18 inches on me. But this is a perfect length for me. Perfect, okay. And it feels really good. And it's gonna work with my edges. Even though the silkier textures still work if I, you know, because I'm using my She Is Bomb edge control, which is really good. I'm noticing I'm gravitating more towards like these headbands versus these here. I don't know if I like these that much, but I haven't tried one on, so let's try it on. Let's try it on with yellow. Oh, yellow. Yellow is my color, y'all. Oh, this is so cute. This is so, this is, I'm definitely keeping this one for sure. Cicely was cute. She was cute and Jeanette was cute, but this one is so me. This is very much me. And I actually do like the headband once I put it on. I like Alpha Woman as a half wig so much more than the lace wig version. Um, I remember the part just being like a little bit too clean and perfect. But I got my hairline out and it's looking good. Oh, and if you're somebody who suffers from alopecia or you have a shaved head, you can wear headband wigs. You're gonna have to finesse it a bit more though. Wigs and Wonderlust, she does have a video up of her uh, reviewing a human hair headband half wig. So check her out to see how it is with somebody who has a shaved head. But baby, Alpha Woman, this is such a cute like, well, I'm gonna say a summer look cause it's still summer cause I got the yellow headband and a tank top on. But this is thick and gorgeous, but it's gonna be better suited for fall, winter. But somebody like me, I'm probably gonna wear this now. This is cute, y'all. Yeah, so far, this is the winner right here. Um, I gotta take some selfies. Yeah, I took some selfies and some footage with this one. 
I love this one. Um, this texture is super soft and natural. The one that I have for my first wig is obviously human hair, a lot more expensive, um, but I think it's worth it. I love that one. But if you are somebody on a budget, you don't care about it being human hair or not, or how long it lasts and all that, look into getting this one. This one is gorgeous. I'm running up and down stairs to take selfies in natural light, so I'm out of breath. This one is really, really pretty. I I love this one. Let's see what we got with the half up, half down. I love the length of this too, because this has layers in it, so you can have a layered ponytail. Yes. I probably like this one more than Annie, but cause it's layered. Look, this is cute. Super cute y'all. I might spend the most time kind of trying on the headbands with this. Cause this is one I'll actually be wearing. Cause some of the ones I feature, I don't think they're necessarily my style. I'm just trying to, you know, show you guys variety, but this one is so me. Let's try it on with this sweater material one. This looks so cute. And you can do a posh low pony. Let's try one of these kind. These are super chunky. I don't. <laughs> I know this is the wave with the chunkier ones, but this look kind of weird on me. I don't really like the chunky ones that are like this. It's not really my style. I don't think it fits my head well. Eh, not really with that. Let me try the olive green. Oh, okay. I feel like they're different sizes. Like it's like a big one. And this is medium size and this fits like smaller and closer to the head. It's still weird though. I'm not a fan of those headbands. Okay, let's see with this one. With this kind of Versace kind of pattern on it. That's pretty cute. A little vacation-y with the color palette. Just for the heck of it, let me try it on with a green one. This will be another long video. Oh my gosh, the footage is gonna take so long to edit, but I enjoy the longer videos and being able to talk to you guys longer, especially in premieres. It's just so much more fun to just look at each wig with you guys and talk about it, you know? This is why you gotta be a part of Premiere Squad. I like these. I said I didn't just by looking at them, but they're super cute. And it's good to have just solid headbands with no pattern that kind of go with any outfit. So, all right, let's turn, let's go to another wig, but I love this one. If you don't get anyone out of this whole entire video, get Alpha Woman, it's gorgeous. All right, so here is the next one. It is also from Sensationals Curls, Kinks and Co collection. And I wanted to get textures that were more close to my hair texture because Sometimes with the silky ones, I can get it together as far as like with really good edge control and stuff, but you don't have to try as hard when you have something that's your texture. So this one is another wig that I have tried in the lace front version, and this is Moneymaker in a color number two. It just looks beautiful on her. I like the shape of it. It is a dupe for Jenna by Janet Collection, which I love. Um, I actually ruined my Moneymaker a few weeks ago, I was trying to be grown and trim it up and I messed it up, but luckily it's inexpensive, so it's okay. So here is what Moneymaker looks like. Tightly coiled or tightly has these ringlets in it, tight ringlets. And it's a number two color, long comb. So Sensational is with the long comb steel. Comb in the back and adjustable straps. Let's. Check it out. Give me big hair. And people are speculating that headband wigs are like the wave now because of the shortage of lace in China. I have heard people talk about this in wig groups and stuff. And um, I've gotten, I've talked about it in my DMs with other 
um, wig influencers. I personally don't care. I'm happy that this is the wave because it's easy, especially during quarantine. People, people might not even see my lace, but you still want to be cute in the house with not all that effort. So I love headband wigs or head or half wigs in general, whether they're synthetic or human hair. But clearly the texture ones have my heart because Alpha Woman was perfection as a as a half wig. You don't have to worry about the part in space looking like too synthetic y or like fake with the half wig version. This is super cute. This kind of looks like crochets. Like a crochet style. So this is the length. Um, I think it's about 14 inches. It's very, very full. So if you're somebody who doesn't like big hair, you probably want to pass on this, but this is my vibe. I love Janet Collections, Jenna, as I told you guys, and I did really like the lace version of this, but I ended up wearing it kind of my own edges out anyway. So, all right, let's do another pearl one. I want to do the pink one again because I think that's just pretty. So adorable. Adorable. This is cute. If so far from all the headbands I've tried, I don't like these. The thick, thick ones. I don't like those, but I do love the pearl ones. These simple ones are super cute. Um, and these are cute. Like I like all of them except for the big, the big velvet ones. This is definitely, it's not going to be exactly like the her given hair wig, but you can get a look very similar with something like this. Okay, so I put on the polka dot one with the bow on it. I told you it looks like Minnie Mouse. And then with the bigger hair, it kind of looks like that. So this will probably be too hot to wear at Disney. I don't know. But eventually I'm going back after Corona leaves. So this is cute. This is cute. All right, last one in this try on video is from Sensational. And this is in the style Amani. I think I reviewed Sensational's Amani, like the lace front version last summer. I think I did. And I have this in a number two. Um, this is what she looks like on the stock card. Some more big hair. I know in this video, it wasn't a lot of like short wigs, but I did a few short ones in part one. So I wanted to do some more that were like more my style in this video. Um, so we got some big, beautiful hair here. This is what Amani looks like. Gorgeous wave to it. It's kind of like Altrace Tammy, but this has a deeper crimp to it and it's thicker, very soft and beautiful. This has a long comb at the front, a comb in the back and adjustable straps with this one. I got a feeling I'm going to like this one too. It's kind of funny, some of the half wig versions of these wigs look better than the lace front versions. Cause sometimes the lace or like the pardon space, the pardon space can kill a wig because it can look a little bit too artificial. Let's rake her out a bit. Fluff her up at the top. Cause I don't want it too flat. This is <laughs> some diva hair. This is pretty. Let me not rake it out too, too much. But you see, you can just look at the luster from here and see how natural that is. Oh my gosh, this is gorgeous. Mm. I feel like a disco queen right now. Let's try it on with, I really have been trying on all of them pretty much with the exception of a few colors. Let's try it on with this Heather Gray sweater headband. I have really enjoyed this video, filming it and everything. It's just been a lot of fun. Yeah, this is a winner too. This is my style. I know a lot of people don't like long hair, but it's a mix of everybody on my channel. I can't feature everything that everybody wants, but I try to do a little bit of everything. But this is super cute, super cute. 
Okay, let me try it with that. Um, I want to try it with this one. Oh my God. I was talking to uh, Miss Naturally Mary because I watched her recent video, one of her synthetic videos, and I was, she was like, she had this on and it looked so bridal and I told her that and she was like, where were these wigs when I got married? And I was like, if, well, I guess she, of course you could wore, you could wear a synthetic one because they look beautiful, but I probably would have wore a human hair headband wig for my wedding too because it just looks so good and you don't have to worry about no lace. This is so beautiful. Oh my gosh. I feel like a princess right now. Like, are you kidding me? I kind of don't even want to try on no other headbands, but just keep this one on. This is so beautiful. This has such a beautiful luster to it. This thickness is perfect for me. Yeah, I think this is pretty. Let me just try on like one other one. Yeah, your hair will get caught up in that one. So just be a little bit careful. But obviously I love this one here because I keep wearing it. But let me see it with this one real quick. That's super cute. All right, so I have tried on, I have showed you my headband haul and I've tried on all these wigs. Out of all of them, the sensational ones are my favorite. Um, Alpha Woman is amazing as a half wig, looks very natural looks very human hair like role model looks gorgeous and Amani looks super natural as well so all of the textured ones are the ones that i love jeanette was cute but i prefer the other the sensational ones just do it for me so i hope you guys enjoyed this video so tell me down below which was your favorite from this haul which one have you already tried are you gonna pick up any let me know out to my premiere squad for rocking with me and tuning in to watch the premiere uh you guys are awesome and you have helped me grow so much august has been a crazy good month on my channel and i appreciate you guys so much if you are new here shout out to you for stopping by please consider subscribing before you leave if you're somebody you like headband you like the look of the headband half wigs and everything but you want some human hair check out my headband wig playlist i have all kinds of human hair ones on there and it's going to be growing over the next month as well and then i have part one so if you haven't watched part one yet to watch that one as well thank y'all so much for tuning in and i will see you guys in the next video bye guys